Hey, Olden Robot here, and today we'll be talking about everything I found in the Batman and Fortnite comic Foundations that just released. There's details about Gino, more about the Zero Point, and another villain of the DC Universe makes their way to the Fortnite Island. Let's jump in. Starting in Metropolis, the comic opens on the Justice League trying to stop the joint forces of Lex Luthor and the Batman who laughed from accessing the Zero Point energy as traces have been found in Gotham. Whilst at Gotham Harbour, the Foundation has awoken and realised that he needs to stop the Zero Point falling into the wrong hands. Greeted by Batman at the shore, they face off in a heated battle, not knowing that they are both trying to defend the Zero Point from evil, and instead arguing over who has the best tech. When the Foundation realises that Batman knows about the Zero Point, and Batman learns about the Foundation is not part of the imagined order, they realise that they are both on the same side. On their way back, they talk of the Seven, how the goal is to stop the Order, liberate the Zero Point and destroy the Loop. From what the Imagine Order is doing isn't natural, they are threatening the balance of the Omniverse itself and how there's a new rift in Metropolis. It reads, In the beginning there was nothing, then in a burst of pure creation the Zero Point sprang into being. Here we call that the Big Bang, how our universe came to exist but it's not just your universe. Countless realities originated from the zero point. Each is its own universe, its own multiverse. Originally, these realities would rarely, if ever, intersect. But the Imagine Order have been manipulating the zero point for a long time, using it to tamper with realities, change the course of their development drastically, often disastrously, and traveling to and from them. Mostly this is done through what I call a pure portal, originating from the zero point itself, which remains linked to all realities. That's what you used. The pure portal can be closed at the source. Opening a sideways rift between two distant realities is far more difficult. The order only learned how recently. These have to heal naturally, which takes time or both sides must be closed at once. The foundation then explains that he's tried to prevent this from happening by closing off the zero point and forming the spire around it, to which Batman realises that the imagined order had been using him the whole time and that he broke through it to come home. They are so fixated on forming their plan to close the sideways rift from both sides that they lose sight of the known enemies that start to attack them. The Foundation and Justice League continue to battle side by side in Gotham, as the perimeter is pushing closer and closer to the rift, the Foundation guesses who friendly, scans who he believes to be Batman based on the bio markers he can identify and helps fly him towards the sideways rift. Unknowing to him is the Batman who laughed, playing tricks on him and they get into a heated battle. Chasing the Batman who laughed into the rift, the Foundation calls for the Justice League to contain the action in Gotham whilst he makes sure that the Batman who laughs will not leave the reality zero. Crashing through the rift and onto Reality Zero, they continue to fight and the Foundation discovers just how powerful the Batman Who Laughs is. The Foundation diverts all available power to his gauntlets and says, This is already my great fear. I live it every day knowing the Zero Point is in the hands of Gino. And I'll be damned if I let the likes of you deny me the chance of putting it right. There's not a lot known about Gino as yet. The character was first mentioned by Agent Jonesy in the Zero Crisis finale back at the end of Chapter 2, Season 5. It is known that Seven feared Gino, and it is now known that Gino controls the Zero Point, which is pretty scary. There are seven seconds till the time loop resets. The Batman who last is down, and the Foundation calls for Batman in Gotham to close the rift. As we know, when the time loop resets, memories of everyone on Fortnite Island are reset, except for those who it can't control like the Foundation. Lex Luthor calls for Plan B, and contains the Justice League in a force field. Batman goes on to say, We sealed the rift. The Foundation did his part which suggests he won. That means the Batman who laughs is stranded in the loop. His memory wiped is one of the few prisons in existence that can hold him. Anyone he kills will be alive again in a matter of minutes and he won't remember who he is or where he comes from. That's a win I'll take. Within Reality Zero, the Foundation confirms it's closed from his side and sets off to find the former Imagine Order member turned ally, Agent Jonesy, so they can determine how much of the island the Imagine Order has retaken, along with if they know of the plans to destroy them once and for all. 
As the loop resets, the Batman Who Laughs confirms that his visor is made of the World Forge, the cosmic metal from the dawn of creation, and similar to what the Zero Point is. This has protected his memory from being reset by the loop, and he's now out to cause chaos on the island. And that's where the comic leaves it, with the Batman Who Laughs saying, I won't be limited to one multiverse anymore. Oh no. This island, the loop, the zero point, and every reality it's linked to, I'm going to put my special touch on all of them. While I don't know about you, but that was a very action-packed addition to the story. We've got Batman, along with the Justice League, locked off in Gotham. Now the sideways rift has been closed. The Foundation is back in Reality Zero, on his way to find Agent Jones, unaware that the Batman who laughs is at large and remembers everything. Could we see the imagined order team up with the Batman who laughs, causing yet more chaos to the Fortnite island as we know it? Will we find out more about Gino as we near the end of the current Fortnite season? Will Batman find a way back to the island to help take down the imagined order? Or will the Foundation be able to destroy the Zero Point once and for all before anyone gets their hands on it? Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to hit that like button to let me know. I'll have more videos soon, so if you don't want to miss out, make sure to hit that sub too. But until next time, have a great day and I'll catch you soon.